This video is all about Melangovich cycles and how the Earth orbits around the Sun today and how it's changed in the past. So there you can see the current situation. The Earth's tilted at an angle of 23.5 degrees to the Sun and that's a slightly elliptical orbit. And don't forget 23.5 degrees is also the uh, latitude of both tropics. On December the 21st or the 22nd, winter, it's the winter solstice, the North Pole faces away from the Sun and day length is at a minimum in the Northern Hemisphere. We get permanent darkness in the North Pole because the Earth points away from the Sun and the heat equator is actually over the Tropic of Capricorn. Three months later, on March the 21st or 22nd, we've got the equinox. And three months after that, on June the 21st or the 22nd, you've got the summer solstice. The North Pole faces the sun, giving 24 hours of daylight there. The heat equator is at the Tropic of Cancer. Three months later again, we've got our next equinox. And then we're back around to the to the start. Now that sequence gives us our seasons and it gives us our variation and in insulation around the, the earth. Now Milutin Milankovic proposed um, three changes to, to that orbit um, as we go around the sun. Um, and that would have drastic consequences for for climate on, on planet Earth. Uh, so the, the first was the 95,000 year stretch. Currently we've got a slightly elliptical orbit. Milankovitch suggested that that could vary from elliptical to circular. Circular orbits would favour glacials. Elliptical orbits favour interglacials as the Earth passes closer to the Sun, allowing more melting. That circular orbit. He also proposed a 42,000 year tilt. So the Earth currently tilted at an angle of 23.5 degrees to the Sun, but he suggested that that can change. A reduction to 21 degrees will cause glacials as there's less summer melting at the poles. Increase to 24.5 degrees causes interglacials as there's more summer melting. And then the 21,000 year wobble. The Earth wobbles on its axis every 21,000 years. That basically means that the seasons would shift um, and that's got big consequences particularly if the Earth's orbit is elliptical because it can have big changes in the amount of insulation that the Earth is receives. So at present our orbit puts the northern hemisphere closest to the Sun in winter and furthest in the summer ideal for glaciers to develop. It was the reverse 12,000 years ago and caused the current interglacial.